Hey YouTube, it's your girl Dr. Divine here on the line. Um, I'm being a little super vulnerable right now. As you can see, there are a couple tears coming out of my eyes. I just wanted to speak on something that is really hard for me to experience. Not just lately, but in general. Um, when it comes to what they consider spiritual warfare and the powers that be, the, the energies that dwell in darkness and the energies that dwell in light the more that i ascend into the light and um i noticed that the harder the darkness tries to consume me and i've created such a strong formula subconsciously that has created somewhat of a barrier of light like a protection all around my energetic field like my aura and so it's not easy for energies of the darkness to penetrate that my auric field. You know what I'm saying? But the issue with that right now is that my loved ones, my parents, such as, you know, when I say my loved ones, I just mean like my parents, my sister and my kids. Um, so since the darkness cannot directly penetrate my auric field i see the darkness seeping into and projecting into my mom or my dad or my sister not like a possession so much it's just that i can see the darkness piercing their energetic aura and 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 projecting their traumas and so there's no way that i can strengthen them subconsciously because it's an individual work you know, but that's how like this week that I've been under attack. I just wanted to share with everybody and share it out loud um, in case anybody else is experiencing this, how normal it is. I can't come to an understanding with my mom. We can't get on the same page, at least not right at this second. There's so much that I'm actually hiding from her to protect her, like what's happening in my life right now. And so I can't really go to her for help because they don't have the proper tools to assist me with with what it is that I'm experiencing right now. And I'm the like I'm the backbone. I'm the one that my family goes to. I'm the matriarch. I'm the person that has the solutions, has the answers. And I'm always looking to God for the answers. It just feels like lately I've been running around in circles though. Trying to take care of the people that I love in the best way that I know how. But sometimes in return, I still feel abandoned. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's hard for me to talk about. I usually don't open up about things like this at all. But hey, why not, right? Since we're putting it all out there, right? This is part of the spiritual journey that a lot of people don't want to talk about. Because it's not always all love and light. There's a lot, a lot, a lot of darkness that comes along with wanting to walk with God. And people should understand that. It's not easy at all. But it is worth it. And if I can be vulnerable and transparent and share my journey with others. So much so that it'll help someone else discover the light within their darkness. Then I'm totally fine with that. This is your girl, Dr. Divine, signing out. <laughs>